started your own yeah. uh, company. Uh, you worked in your father's company. What did you learn there? Uh, I worked in my father's company in 88, I remember. And I learned a lot, of course. I was young in that time and uh, established uh, a lot of companies. Mm -hmm. uh, my father gave me uh, full support and uh, opportunity to start and to join with a different partner of his partner okay. uh, European Indian different nationalities of course uh, I learned a lot of things from uh, what is that you learned what is that unusual if you can list out a few uh, things that you I learned. learned from my father I can say uh, a lot of things I have to start early morning okay I have to be uh, example for all my staff mm -hmm. uh, which is I'm continue with that uh, okay. until now uh, my word should be one. I mean, when I give a word to uh, any person, is like a contract, like I sign contract. Oh, okay. I have to respect that. Whatever I didn't sign until now, mm -hmm. if I give a word, they have to be in my word. Whatever. If I lose also, but if I give him a word, that's you it. have to yeah. keep like it. a contract. Yeah, I have to keep it. Wow. Learn a lot of things. I mean, uh, yes, from a father yeah. you learn so yeah, many things. Of course, things. yeah, of course. Uh, but you start your day early, then. which is very unusual for. See, I start uh, to learn from my father when. You can see in the age of eight, nine. Okay. I was going with him. He was mm -hmm. just uh, uh, he was, was he was working in the finance uh, ministry mm -hmm. or the ministry of finance, and I was going with him in that time. And he was the head of the purchase department okay. of the old UAE. And I was going with him. He signed the paper. I have to take the paper from uh, person right. to person. He is as a head of the department. From there, I start to build, I can see the best thing I learned, the relation. Relation mm -hmm. is help mm -hmm. always in the business. Mm -hmm. I start to know a lot of people. Mm -hmm. They are older than me, but uh, I have a, I'm the person which is, I like to talk to the people and to build the relation. Okay. That's uh, helped me a lot there. Okay. What is a day in the life of Saif Pelasa? What do you do from morning to evening? Uh, you start I start, see, I start early morning. What time? Uh, it depends because I pray early morning okay. and sometimes coming 5 30, sometimes 4 30. Sometimes, you know, yeah, but I go to the, the, the mosque, pray early morning, and after that, I go direct to that. This is how I sat before, but now a little I change, I become a okay. little lazy. <laughs> but I was uh, going early morning, you can say before two years, I was going to the mosque. From the mosque, I will go direct to the office, mm -hmm. uh, sometimes 5 30, sometimes 6 o'clock. And when nobody's there except they have one office boy, which is he's the one which is he pray also in the morning. Okay. But we sit and I finish my work, he prepare all my checks, all the paper, uh, paper so everything. So before the office do, comes, yeah. you are in office. Exactly. I finish wow. all my work and uh, at eight o'clock, uh, my staff they will we'll start come. And they feel a little bad because I'm <laughs> hard, but I finish already my work. Okay. I mean, mm -hmm. I mean, this is how I start. Uh, uh, after that, the staff will come, they will mm. come and they will have to uh, see manager and mm. different companies and yes. interviews, a lot of things. We are doing because you have multiple people. businesses. Multiple, yeah. I have around 25 companies mm. and uh, I enter, yani I'm speaking to one manager of, um, about the restaurant line mm. of business, sometimes driving to school, sometimes yeah. car testing, money exchange, yeah. different international business I have also. But uh, I feel uh, I feel excited also mm -hmm. because I learn a lot of things and uh, if some business not doing well, another business mm -hmm. making uh, doing well and make me happy, mm -hmm. and I feel and this is uh, a way of my uh, daily. Uh, yeah, I sit until uh, uh, at the moment until one o'clock. Okay. Uh, one o'clock I'll go home mm -hmm. and uh, sometime two o'clock. It depends mm -hmm. because there is no time. Depends. Sometimes I put right. a meeting at two uh, two o'clock. I have to be in the office. Right. I go at three o'clock. I eat my lunch uh, with my wife and uh, uh, my children. And after that, uh, hundred person, I will have uh, people waiting for me in the farm. Okay. Uh, so that the some, next part of the yeah, day is the farm. Thing. Yeah, that's the. I have some football player or whatever singer, uh, name it actor, and uh, okay. all the famous people they are coming to the farm, and I build a good relation. Okay. How I was from the eighth. So age how, of eight. Okay. Yeah, so the farm, was it something that you started? You already had one or you started the farm from the beginning? You were no, interested no, no, in animals? No, no. I was, I had this farm, it was for the, uh, I was horse breeder. Yes. As a hobby. Yeah. Uh, for Arabian horses. And I was riding horses also, okay. marathon horses. But uh, with the time I got allergic with the horses. Okay. 
I can't uh, when I smell them I get tired and okay. uh, I start to use some medicine injection but didn't help okay. it helped me for some mm-hmm. with the time I start uh, one of my friend he brought small lion for me I remember okay. in the age of uh, 25 days okay. 25 days days yeah and with the milk and they put him inside I feed him his name is uh, Jack okay or Jackie Uh-huh. Uh, anyway, we feed him and we, I felt nice, I mean, to be with the lion and uh, he, we, I, I, this is how I start the zoo. How, how different is a lion than a dog? Is it because uh, he's in see, captivity? The, the, dog, the dog close to the lion, I'm saying, he is. yeah, he's a respect and uh, he's loyal Love, to his, yeah. uh, uh, to his owner, uh, but he, of course, he's the king of the jungle. Yes. Uh, he was with us or with me in the house. Mm-hmm. until uh, age of maybe around one year after that we put him in the cage okay. uh, and I start this is how I start my okay. uh, my hobby okay. I start to breed them I feel enjoy when they're okay. coming with the babies I start to spend more money and so money. this lion is from which part of, uh, is it an African lion? African, African brown African lion. Uh, okay. mm-hmm. so now I have I think around 350 uh, animals okay. different line of animals alhamdulillah I have everything I, I I enjoy that. That's my hobby. Second half and of the yeah, day yeah, is, yeah. is it make fun. me relax. Of okay. course, make me relax, and uh, allow me to uh, to see different people. Mm-hmm. People they love to see the farm. I have yes. a, a big list of uh, all big people, and they love to see the, the farm. Yes, of course. I put program for them, and we, I see them and spend time, build a relation, and okay. And the good thing, I mean, they like uh, some people, which is. Yeah, and like uh, I have yesterday, I have somebody mm. which is already he came twice before, right? And he's still insisting, please, my I son, he wants to see, wants see. To see. Okay. and my wife, see, please. Okay. So I allow them also uh, to come to and come see the farm. Yeah. So right. Always we have somebody there. Okay. Uh, so you've been a successful businessman in the UAE. What are the five important things you will see? You will advise to young entrepreneurs. What should they absolutely do to start a good see, business? I feel always respect that time. Okay. Respect the people which are working with you and uh, your word hmm. also. You have to keep in your word. Hmm. Uh, you have to work hard, of course. Uh, the business is not easy. You know. You have hmm. to work hard to uh, to achieve what you want to achieve. Right. What's more? Uh, yani this is what I feel is important in okay. our life. Uh, Yeah, this is and what branch out into many businesses like what you did. Yeah, of course. Uh, my see uh, normally in the biz- in, in Dubai, mm. uh, Dubai is uh, new. Yes. Maybe, uh, but that's why uh, we have opportunity to uh, do a lot of things, uh, mm. and Dubai still need a lot of things. Now maybe the competition is uh, is big, but uh, we, I love. I do. I feel uh, fed up if I am in one business. No, I like to. Uh, to learn some different business and uh, I'll see where is the good opportunity to do. Okay. Yeah. You've supported Bollywood always and uh, okay. so what is that one Bollywood star who's made an impact on you? You met so you many see, of them. Yeah, see, I know Salman Khan. Yeah. Yeah, Salman, he's a good friend. He's a good human being. He have a good heart, uh, which is, I mean, he's as a brother to me, mm-hmm. which is uh, always I have, uh, I respect him and uh, I learned a lot of things from him also. Yeah. And uh, that's why we have a good relation, alhamdulillah. Okay. Any Bollywood film that you like very much that you remember? Any song that you like very much? Do you follow Hindi? Do you speak? Uh, yeah, of course. I know. <laughs> and of course, I know. And of course, yeah, we mix with a different... Uh, yes, yes. But that's why we have to learn the language, uh, the Indian language. Uh, I don't know the name of the movie, but I know a lot of uh, movies, which is for Salman, for Shah Rukh, for... Okay. Uh, Uh, but uh, you can't okay. yeah, yeah. But of course, uh, I, I I like the Indian movie. Was, Which is the first Bollywood celebrity you met? You remember? As a child, because Dubai, everyone comes to Dubai all the time. Uh, you tell me who you know better. <laughs> yeah, because I will not know. But Salman as uh, yes, good I'm not because, talking about now. Yeah. I'm talking about Salman. Before. I know him from long time. Okay, but uh, before Saif that, Ali Khan. Okay. Okay. Uh, I know him. We sat together. He visit my office. Don't think the first time you met a Bollywood star. Do you remember as a child or as an adult or as a growing up person? No, Dubai? no. You don't remember. No. Okay. I don't remember. Because my Dubai memory is so weak. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but yeah. Uh, of course. But I remember, of course, as, uh, as uh, Amit Bachchan. I yes. mean, he's well known yes. as a person. When we are small, yes. we we know he's a big star. Of yes. course. 
this is the old, right? But I don't want to say old because by this way, meaning my no, age no, no, no. <laughs> will be calculated. Okay. Yeah. You visited India several times. Have you visited yes. the stars yes. as well? Yes. You visited course, yeah. them yeah. as well? Okay. Right. Uh, how do you unwind? You travel so much. You are such a you know busy person. Yeah. How do you keep, you know, unwind? Is that the farm that unwinds you or is there anything more also that you like that you unwind? With? See, uh, I tra- travel a lot. Yeah. Uh, that's make me a little relax mm-hmm. as a business travel makes you relax relax yeah okay. because it's sometimes yeah because what's my travel i'm studying at the moment studying yeah studying a phd but already PhD I've, in, what? in the business administration oh yeah but that's why i have tra- to travel uh, in a month thrice where do you go to, to uh, egypt Oh. But I go and study. But this is make me sometimes when I don't go now, like we finish the course, mm-hmm. I feel sometimes oof, I didn't go. But I go. So you're uh, a yeah, yeah. student who flies to Egypt yeah, for. Yeah. Exactly wow. For study, yeah. Okay. It's uh, tiring for me, of course. Mm-hmm. I have a lot of business. Mm-hmm. But uh, sometimes also we have not to stop. We have to learn more and study. You're a more. student somewhere. I am a student. I finished already the master's degree. Okay. And uh, now I start, uh, I finished PhD. the first course of the PhD. Yeah. So you have a guide over there. Who, exactly. And what are you specializing on? In the business administration. Oh, and That's you're enjoying it? And enjoying it. I mean, do you have homework to do? Do you have I to? I have do? a lot of uh, exam, of course. <laughs> uh, exam, we make yeah, a lot. Okay. A lot yeah. As like a student, it? when I'm there, as a student, honestly, because we are in the college with a student, okay. uh, you feel you are a student and I enjoy that. It's a great experience. Yeah, I'm sure. it's nice. It's nice. So, ha- after how long have you gone to college? Uh, how many? I mean, yeah, maybe after uh, you can say fifteen, fifteen okay. years. Yeah. Uh-huh. Okay. I finished. I graduate long time. Yeah. But I said, let me to start again. That's an amazing yeah, thing. I have, I have it in my heart. And, so you uh, also are into education apart from this businesses business and side. traveling and the farm. So, so farm, yeah. anything that you've not done. Uh, see, I'm in the sport. In the yes. sport, I'm riding horses, swimming, mm. uh, different thing, uh, volleyball. But okay. not, I mean, we don't have, of course, I mean, gym, mm. all of that. Mm. Know. But uh, I did everything in my life, I can say. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm enjoying. And uh, I love, I mean, I, I, I'm enjoying my life. How do you see the next, uh, tw- how do you see 2020 happening in Dubai? And what, what do you think about it? See, 2020 is... Uh, I think for Dubai, mm-hmm. UAE, yes, I can yes. say, not only yeah. just Dubai, for UAE, it will be, I think, a good year. Mm-hmm. Uh, the market is difficult. Mm. Uh, it's, I can say uh, everybody's uh, uh, they're feeling uh, tired of what they are seeing. Uh, but I think with the uh, Expo 2020, I think it's helping Dubai. Mm. Uh, this year, 2020 is a difficult year for mm. everyone. Yes. Uh, we can feel it from the uh, 2019. And we know this will be for us a difficult year. But we have to do our best. We have to innovate and yeah, move yeah, on. Yeah. Okay, tell us about the launch of KA1. Yeah. See, I started this brand before two years. Okay. And uh, I start uh, now to focus more on it. Mm-hmm. That's why any uh, of the uh, celebrities coming to the, my farm, I give mm-hmm. them the uh, to wear this. Oh, okay. And uh, start to go. I mean, mm-hmm. out, I open uh, uh, two branches, one in Roma and one in uh, Milan. Okay. And we're going to cover all Europe. Okay. And uh, what I is unique the, about this brand? Unique because Safe is handling that. It's my own brand. Okay. But that's why, and unique because I give it also to that. You're my, uh, uh, you're yeah. attached to it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But that's why I feel it's something, uh, I want sometimes to give a gift for the, my. Uh, visitor in the farm. I mm-hmm. feel this is the best gift I give them. Okay. And they are very happy also to support me in that. Absolutely. But uh, I feel as uh, we came with a new uh, with the Italian design mm-hmm. and he is very good. I okay. feel the collection is beautiful. Okay. And not I'm saying because the people they are saying mm-hmm. every day. But it's make me happy and make me also busy. Okay. It's very small business for me. It's not I'm depending on you know, a small business. Mm-hmm. And it will be a small business, but it will grow as a big name, mm-hmm. I can say, in the KA1. Okay. But that's why I support it more. Why did you that. choose this name? Uh, this is Twas uh, with the uh, brand Twas with the, uh, from UK. 
Okay, it's okay. a brand new brand, yeah, yeah. yeah, I brought it from him and I started and then to, you're uh, yeah. taking it first. Exactly. Yeah. Lovely. And this is available in uh, across uh, the UAE? We have it in the all the malls with okay. the uh, galleries. Like Gallery Lafayette uh, also. Yeah. I, I appreciate their support, honestly. Okay. Mm-hmm. It's making me very happy and uh, I'm proud and glad to, to put also my collection with them. Okay. And uh, this is how it goes. Yeah. Thank you very much for speaking to You're me. It was welcome. absolutely beautiful to talk to you. Thank you. My pleasure. Thank you.